Hello Tina, what are you making today? Ah, oh, hi. I'm making potato and onion curry. Oh, okay. For my rabbit friends. Rabbit friends, what's that? Well, people who eat only non veg, okay. which is, what is that? All the leaves and all the, the potatoes and all the root vegetables. And okay, so vegetarian veggie, basically. Vegans. Vegan, yeah. okay. Especially dedicated to Michael. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, right, the then. one who is going to protect all the animals. So what yes. does this include? So this is so simple, easy, lazy way to make a um, curry. It's a sort of curry. My mother may, may, used to make this one. It's so simple and easy. And only three ingredients we use in it. And it's so easy. Anybody can make here in UK. All the ingredients we get it in UK. Okay, so, it's so, what, simple. so what are they? Potato. As you can see, potato. Yes. And then onions. Mm -hmm. Finely sliced and then medium sized chunky potato peeled and cut potato. And then what you need is only three ingredients as I said. Ground coriander. Okay. Ground chili. And then obviously turmeric. Okay. okay. That's all you need. And then little bit of shallot to garnish. Of what sorry? Shallot. 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 shallot okay. A shallot, yeah. Okay. To garnish. And that's all you need. And oh. then if you can get some um, what's the mustard seed, you can use it, but there is no guarantee. There is no need to urgency to get that. You know? okay. So you can use that um, just a shallot, you know, to garnish it. Okay. Right. So a little bit of salt. Okay. Yeah. Salt, then the as you like. And as you can see little bit of turmeric as you know this is homemade turmeric powder which i got from back home and then obviously ground coriander two tablespoons you can use a bit bit more mm -hmm. and a little bit of chili powder it depends on how hot you want but i don't use much for you because i know that it's not good and what else you need is a bit of water. Okay. Okay, you can add a bit more water if you want. Need to cook well, you know. So what usually I do when it boil, it starts boiling, I can add some more um, some more of uh, hot water. Okay. Just stir it well. You can, you can smell nice smell, isn't it? You can smell, yeah. Yeah. So that's that's the main ingredient. You know? Okay. So then so simple. And then put it there. You need to cook it. Right? How long does that take then? Oh, it's about uh, 15 20 minutes, you know. Okay. I think only thing it depends on, you know, how much you cook and um, it depends on the potato. It's take only 15 20 minutes. When it's nicely boiled, add we can add a little bit of hot water. You know, to cook longer time to make okay. it nice and soft for the potato, you know. Mm. Oh, and um, yeah, and then we add some milk, little bit of drop of milk, you know, just to get a little flavor. Okay. Ordinary milk. You don't need to use the coconut milk. Ordinary um, milk you use for making tea. Okay. Uh, cow's milk, obviously. And um, I got three shallots here. I'll chop it finely. Okay. And sometimes, you know, it depends if you got mustard seed, it's fine. Otherwise, you just put a little bit of oil, um, saute this shallot, and then garnish it. Even it's completely cooked and leave it for a couple of minutes. And then it's nice to go with the curry mm -hmm. yeah. or bread. Oh, you yes, know, bread. it's nice. Mm. I'll show you when it cooks, okay? Okay. Yeah. Right, what are you up to now, Jean? Yeah. Our... Um, Potato and onion is boiling nicely. It's cooking. As you can see, let me stir it well. See, I can add a bit more water or I'll wait for, let it cook a bit more than I can add milk rather than adding water, you know. So, we'll get a nice thick sauce then, you know. So, then also, I'm going to make this, we're going to have rice and uh, this one and then something else. Uh, my friend who is very fussy, she doesn't like this king prawns. 
So I had some fish pie mix in the fridge. Okay. I know that here we use fish pie with this fish pie mix. So what I will do, I can fry it. It's nice with the nice to go with the rice, you know. So a simple, easy, simple, lazy way. This is for me, the king prawns. tiger prawn. And then this is for my friend. Okay? Because she doesn't like this one. Again, have a magic spice buddies. This is the main thing we use. We can elaborate it in different way, but this is simple, easy, lazy way we are making it. We both are hungry. We didn't eat anything all this morning rather than Coco Pop. Sorry, Choco Pop. Coco Pops. Coco Pops. Pop. Pop. Choco Pop. Poco Choc. Okay. <laughs> I still struggle. Coco Pops. <laughs> I still struggle to say that. Anyway. So for that, we're going to have a lunch or brunch or supper brunch or whatever it is, you know. We're going to have it with the rice. I'm going to cook it. Potato curry and then fish fry for my mixed pie for my friend and then prawns for me. So the same ingredients we are using. Salt, chili powder and turmeric. So I'm going to make my friend her ass burned. <laughs> See? And cheese. And the same ingredient I use for my prawns. Okay? It's so simple. And obviously a turmeric. Lovely turmeric. You know this turmeric has a lot of um, um, Ayurvedic herbal medicinal effect in it. Okay. Anti-inflammatory. Apparently some research shows that it's good for dementia. I don't know. In that case, my friend needs a lot of this turmeric to prevent having dementia or stop progressing dementia. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> I salt and salt again. Depends on how much salt you want. Yeah. Right. So what I can I can I got a glass. What I can I can marinate it like that. Just just to. It's not the it's word a, we use marinade. It's like a seasoning. Seasoning. Yeah. That's the word, isn't it? Yeah. You know. See, simple, seasoned it with the salt and, if you want, you can add some uh, peppers. Do you right. want some pepper? Yeah. Yeah, black well, pepper? Yeah, a little bit of black yeah. pepper. Yeah. I'm not very keen on a pepper. I'm not a pepper person. I like, I just, this is enough for me. So I'll add some uh, pepper for your um, fish pie mix for fry. Okay. Okay. Perfect. I get some, uh, but it's going to be hot though. I, I'll use that one. What do you think? Yeah, I'll get some. <clears throat> this is black pepper. Okay. So I can use a pinch of it. It's very hot, man. It's not like the ordinary one. It's like a black pepper. Little. Little, okay. See? It's a, it's a real one. You mm. can smell it. Mm. It's not like the ordinary one. There we go. Okay. And see, just sprinkle it and then just season it. That's it. And then and I show you what. So I think our Remove this one now, okay? Just to gear, get some little bit of freedom. Now, this is nearly done, I think. So I put on high flame. Right. See, as you can see, it's getting nice and thick mm. and it's cooked. Mm. As you can see, when you cook, you'll get a nice thick sauce, you know, because the potato is all cooked. You can add a little bit of milk it's your choice if you want to use coconut milk you can use but it's easy way we always have some milk in the house so it's better to use ordinary milk it's not gonna make any difference anyway in UK we are not using the freshly squeezed coconut milk so we can use the ordinary milk and that give a nice taste anyway you know as you can see mm -hmm. see and then when it goes Let it boil and then I will stop it. Let me check the salt now. Mm. 
it's enough salt in it. But I will add a bit more because my friend likes a bit more salt in it. Okay. So that's done. That's done. So let it. Then just leave it down, is it? Yeah, just um, let it boil. When it boil, we're gonna stop it. And you're waiting for it to garnish the shallot. I'll show you now what to do. Nice. Let it boil. See, it's boiling now, as you can mm. see. You see that? Mm. So, boiling now. I'm gonna turn the heating of the hob off and the knife. Pan, non-stick pan, always use the non-stick pan. That saves your time and your energy, basically. Okay, so just put the non-stick pan, heat the pan, and then when it's heat, you put a little bit of, this is actually coconut milk. Just like a solid coconut. You need a little bit, only, only a, a teaspoon or a tablespoon. You need. Can you buy that from anywhere? What's that? Is, oh, I bought it from Aldi. Yeah. Aldi is cheap though, one pound sixty nine. Mm. But if you go to Sainsbury and all, it's more expensive. I don't know what is the difference. It's about three pounds something, and I see same size, five pound in Sainsbury. Oh, good gosh. It seems like all same. I don't know what is the difference. Mm. Virgin coconut oil, mm. so it's more expensive. Mm. Nobody touch. So <laughs> I don't. Maybe this is used and abused. This one. That one. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So the pan is hot now. Put a little bit of. You can use any 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 oil. You don't have to use the coconut. But if you use the coconut, if you like the coconut flavor, you can use coconut milk. That's what we back home we use, you know. And so when it's all melted, you can smell it. It's nice smell, isn't it? You smell it? Yeah, I can smell it. Smell of coconut. Mm. You can use the sunflower oil, but I don't know. You'll get the same effect. You still you can use it. Right. This is called mustard seed. This is what we got. We mm -hmm. got, um, what is that, mustard sauce here, is it? Mustard, yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's not that. I don't think so. They made just mustard, mustard, isn't it? You put on yeah. like That's the yellow mustard, isn't it? Yeah. 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 But this is actually mustard, mustard seed. Mustard seeds. As you right. can see. See? Okay. And when you put in the hot oil, it's going to pop. Okay. You wait until it's completely pop. And then you put the sliced shallot. Okay, as you can okay. see, it's nicely hot. I'm going to put there. You wait now, it's going to pop. Mm -hmm. Yes. See? That's <laughs> what usually I do. <laughs> okay. When it's completely pop. You know, but when we were young, we were so scared to see this one. Yeah. And then when I used to start cooking you know, <laughs> like that, like that, you know, not to, <laughs> not to pop in your eyes, you know, we were so scared. But now we'll even be able to keep your face close to the popping yeah. mustard, you know, tasty. Mm. So I'm gonna saute or oh. nicely fried brown color one. Mm. Yeah. You need to brown it nicely. Not so, yeah, nicely for there. So, where do you get the mustard seeds from then? You, buy you can get it in any Asian shop here. I usually buy um, when I come from India, you know. Oh. Usually, when I go on holiday, I buy it. And if, it, if you keep it in an airtight, dry container, you can use it for long. Mm. That is, I don't think so, any expiry there. But I'll use it. It depends on how much I cook, you know. So, as you can see, that. It's gonna be need to brown it nicely. Now then, as you can see, our um, shallot is nicely uh, fried. See, it's nice yes, and nice. brown. Yeah. So I'm gonna turn the heating off. Heating the hob off. The flame off. So as you can see, nice smell, right? Yeah. So yes. now. This is where we garnish it back home, right? Put it there and you hear that smell, sour. Yes. And then you get a nice smell. Yeah. Any 
very much. Yeah. And what usually we do is my mother used to say that. Put some there. Oh. And then stir it well, right? And then you get a nice smell. So not to lose that this smell. Is nice. Not to reduce that smell and taste. You cover it for 10 minutes. Then it's all infused into the curry, all the lovely flavor, you know. Okay. And then you know the brown, you know, the fried shallot. And the popped mustard seed, everything is really mixed well and then infused in the curry and this is nice. Mm. You, know, you, need, you shouldn't open it now until you toast. until you ready to eat. So leave it there. So our curry is done. So now I'm gonna make the fish fry. Pan here. And got two pan here. <laughs> one for my tiger prawns. One for Fish pie mix fry for my friend. Okay. I put the heating on. You see there? I think she's um, really hungry, I think. <laughs> yeah. So. Again. What do you fancy? Coconut milk or olive oil? What do you want? Coconut. Yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. Now done. Yes. For my friend, we are actually finished. We have done a lot of cooking, right? Look, I got some more there anyway, and I bought more today. Haha, <laughs> it's on offer in Aldi. So I bought this one. What is it? It's all sealed. Well. Did you have to queue for it? Oh no, I didn't go for the tissue paper, see? <laughs> ah, I don't know what's wrong with the people. They think that COVID is affecting their ass. They all are fighting for the tissue paper. It's a respiratory illness if they get it. Oh, come on, people. Oh, yeah. So, again, we're thin coconut oil. Yeah, uh, I need more of this. This is for the prawns, okay? So, I'm gonna use this, my friends, fish pie mix. Right, okay, I'm gonna put it there. Let it fry, let it fry, let it fry. Right, leave it there for five ten minutes and you can put it on the full flame and then this is for my dear tiger prawn okay i think it's hot now it won't take that long though to fry it but that takes a bit longer See? Melt all the coconut. So, you want to see our curry? How is it look yeah. like? Yeah. Nice. Oh, that's rather sweet. Yeah. You want to taste some of it? Some of it? Yeah. There you go. And potato. I'll get it in a, uh, in a bowl now. Yeah. Hmm? yeah. 
I know, it's your favorite, your potato. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Okay, try now. Mm. Nice. Yeah, you like it hot anyway? Mm. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Very nice. Hey, Mike, do you think that Michael like it? Yeah, I think it? so. All right. This is shallot, lovely. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's shallot garnished with the shallot, isn't mm. it? Very nice. Yeah, that's give a nice flavor mm. though. And it's healthy. You haven't added anything extra fat or anything in it, is it? No, very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Here we are. Our uh, fish pie mix pie is better. Nearly done. It depends on how brown you want. Mm. You want it really crispy? Well, you know me. Yeah. Well, I'm not going to have a really, really crispy one. No, that's because nice. it's a different um, um, size, you know. Yeah. So it's difficult to make everything in the same uh, level of... Frying, you know? right, yeah, I know. That's nice. Yeah. See, as you can, this small one is nice to fry. The big one, I don't think so. It's, no, it's okay. difficult, you know. Okay. I put it on the low flame, we'll see. see? Ah, look at my king fawns. Look, 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 look. Yeah? Yes. And you know what I did? Oh, they are brown, aren't they? Yeah. yeah. But these are actually the spices. Ah, yes, I can see. And I put one shallot, finely sliced, I put it on the half of the... Um, a half way of frying, I put some shallot as you can see that there. The shallot there, yes. See, you yeah, see that? I can see, yeah, 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 very nice. See? Yeah, that's what it is. And it's just perfect, can cook nicely. You can eat it. Mm. You want to try it? Cook nice, isn't it? Yeah, it looks very nice. Yeah, yeah see, and that's nearly done too. That's good. Right? There we are. We're gonna yeah. turn the flame off, we leave it there, and ah. let it set. I'm gonna make some rice now. Okay. So I'm gonna boil some water. I'm gonna cook basmati rice, uh, boiled basmati rice. It's so easy to make. But if you're gonna use the long grain rice, it takes longer to cook. Okay. We both are hungry. We both want to taste the curry and the fry. So therefore, I'm gonna use the basmati rice. Okay. I got basmati rice there. Usually use. This is, you know, like yeah, this is the one. Is the quarter cup it is, I think. Right, okay. okay. Yeah. So one. two quarter cup is enough for me to eat. Yeah. So I take the double about. So it's just enough for both of us half each. Okay. You get that? Yeah. Otherwise. You cook it, you eat it straight away. If you're gonna leave it, it's gonna be soggy and clustery. Mm -hmm. It won't be nice, you know. So once you cook it, drain it, you need to eat straight away. This is, I'm making it a plain boiled rice, okay? It's not a fried rice. No. I can show you how to make easy, simple fried rice next time. But this is what I'm using just to, how to make a okay. nice, um, boiled rice. basmati rice. Okay, I'm just going to wash the rice. Uh, Alright. Okay. Do you always do that? I do always do that. Never seen that. We, don't, we never use rice without washing. Okay? I don't know why. Because probably get off all the dust and everything. Okay? <coughs> rice and water and then uh, just boil it for 5-8 minutes and then you always need to check 
squeeze the rice and you know that basically it's cooked it is nice and soft. You know? Ah, right, okay. And make sure that it shouldn't be overcooked. If it's overcooked, you won't get the right texture of the rice, you know. Okay. And the taste won't taste that much, but the texture will be completely changed, you know. Okay. Is it is a bit tricky. I'm still take years for me to learn how to cook the rice. You know, it's always difficult. But and it depends on different types of rice. You can't cook the rice always with the same time, the same amount of water. It depends on how you cook it. If you're making fried rice, never drain the rice. Right. Okay? okay. So you add the right amount of water to cook it, and then all the water soak into the rice or absorb into the rice. You know. Ah, that's okay. But this is just a boiled basmati yeah, rice, right. a simple way, unhealthy way. Okay. There's no added fat in it, you know. Is it true that you shouldn't um, reheat rice then once you've cooked it? It depends. Back home, mm. you always reheat it, you right. know. Okay. Um, some people don't like it, I don't know why. But if you're making homemade fried rice, you can keep it in the fridge for a few days. Ah, yes. And it's really good. You can reheat it, you can microwave it, you know. Yes. And right. uh, some people don't like it, I don't know. But yeah. again, fried rice, you fry it in a little bit of oil so that that keep the rice really long, 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 Last longer, know? yeah. Last longer, yeah. Yeah. Um, but this one I think is better to eat straight away. That's why you don't cook too much. Yeah. Just just enough for you to eat it, make it, you know. Okay. Yeah. What are you doing? Oh my gosh, Tina. <laughs> Haven't you got any plates in your house? <laughs> there's a planet. Okay. <laughs> right. So get another plate, serve it into the plate. Too much for PC. He's, oh right, okay. Is that what you always do, is that? You save the water, save yeah, the soap, yeah. save the planet and energy. This is the way, save the planet. Okay. Is that oily or is it? Yeah, perfect. Just nice, is it? Maybe I didn't make it really, really fried. Yeah, maybe. Mm. I don't like it. I don't think so anybody like that. Mm. Just perfect. Just cooked it. Oh, yes. right. Very Cook bad. Perfect. And then, yeah. if you want to add more shallot or onion, you can add it, you know. Mm. But I add a little bit just for a trial, you know. But it's nice. Onion, uh, sorry, shallot and prawns go really well. Oh, right. Well, shallot is very nice, mate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was nice texture. Nice, just, uh, nice yes. flavor, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. See? Very good. Okay. This one. Enjoy. Mm. I don't think so. This, this will last until I cook the rice. I don't think so. I think you'll be having rice on its own, Tina. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Mm, what are you doing now? Well, you can't beat them, you join them. What are you doing now? Eating. Why? Because you won't, won't give me a plate. <laughs> is that the reason? I thought you were going to save the planet. No, no, it's because you won't give me a plate. <laughs> oh, is that the reason? <laughs> okay, the plate is in the cupboard there. We can have it. No, it's quite but nice. I'm quite happy you, you eat it like that, mind. <laughs> right, what's next, Auntie? Ah, right, I think. Our um, rice is cooked. You can add plenty of water, mind you. Know, you don't have to measure the water because we're going to drain the water anyway. Mm. Um, the rice should be completely covered with the water. And then it's cooked. You can turn it off. So just leave it for a few seconds. So, what I'm going to do, how to drain it. It's easy way to drain. Where is it? Oh. Okay. This one, you see where? What I'm gonna do? In UK, when you drain rice into the sink, always leave the tap open. You know why? Hmm. Otherwise, you know when because of the cold weather, when this rice powder go into the, the the drain, it's all gonna be like a thick cloth. Cloth, you know. So to prevent that, always leave the tap open. Tap so I heard that you know, the Asian people who live in a lot of Asian one area. They always they get the blockage problem, isn't it? Yeah, you know? yeah. So Definitely. therefore, make sure that when you drain it, uh, leave the tap on. Okay. Then all these uh, rice water dilute. Okay. Just easy, lazy way. That's good way, do it. Yeah. You that? But if you have too much rice, you won't be able to do that, you know. Oh. Then you you need to use the proper strainer. Alright, oh, okay. Yeah. Have you seen the strainer? We've seen the strainer before. Yeah, the right. The ordinary strainer. Yeah, big one. Yes. Yeah, you need the yeah. big one. See? So the water is draining as you can see. Yeah? Yeah. And this rice is not overcooked as you can see. It's still chunky. 
Well, not too chunky, but it's not it's not the clustering, you know. No, that's true. Yeah. And the peculiarity of rice, even you drain it and you take it off from the hog, you continue to cook in the heat. Right. So make sure that if you if you already cooked well here, continue to cook, then it will be all cooked. So ah. when you look at like that, look, see. That looks like fluffy, you know. Yeah, fluffy. It should be fluffy. Yeah. See. Yeah. And it's just. Enough. Yeah. Yes. And it's, it's soft, but it's not overcooked. Okay. And it's not undercooked either, you know. Mm. Yes. Ready? And you're going to serve it to save the planet. How much rice you want? That's enough. Yeah, 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 enough. Thank you. Save the planet now. Here you go. Potato. Yeah. Yeah. Have it the rice. You want some more? No, that's fine. Thank you. And you can have potato later anyway. And I all like in a, your brand new plates. Yeah, brand new plates. Yeah. <clears throat> Save the planet. Save the water. Water is very precious. Like your blood. Anna? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Thank you, Tina. Oh. You're welcome.